Alright guys, we hopefully have a pretty easy matchup against the Rice Owls. Let's take a look at our recruiting board. We are top for some people, mainly DNs, halfbacks, a few tight ends. We have also signed three players. Man, we got we got lots of DNs and tackles. Lots of DNs and tackles. DN tackle. Some crappy wide receivers. There's a QB. All right. We have signed a tight end and athlete who is a QB and another QB. All right, guys. We are going to play the Rice Owls, but let's take a look at the rest of our schedule. All right. Heisman watch first. Grayson McCall is still top of the Heisman list. We are currently 6-0, looking to be 7-0 with a huge win against Rice. That's what we want to see. We want to see a blowout. But how will that go? We're pretty evenly matched up. 75 offense to 77 offense. 77 defense to 78 defense. All right, we got some visiting prospects coming in. They'll be a huge factor as to what I do offensively. I need to pass for a certain amount of yards and rush for a certain amount of yards. All right, guys, let's see if Coastal Carolina can come out with a huge win against the Rice Owls. Make sure to like and subscribe. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. Hey, check by 33. Check by 33. Easy, easy, easy. Lucky night. He's under pressure. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. He's taken down at the 41-yard line, and he has a huge game. Yeah, I like the decision-making ability of this quarterback. He looks and looks. He sees nothing. He didn't get rattled. He sees some green in front of him, and he takes off, ends up with a great run. From their own 41-yard line, first down. Pitches, and he's got room. Gains his way to the 49-yard line. You like to see a team having success like this running the football. It can really open up things for the offense. Incomplete. Can't blame him for not hanging on to that pass. He got hit pretty hard. From the 49 yard line, second down. made the 37 yard line i credit the quarterback on that pass he made a great read and delivered a very nice pass for the first down we've got a first and 10 ball on the 37 brought down at the 28 they go with a run and that'll be a gain of nine that brings up second and nine A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. And he throws right away. In the air. It's intercepted. That was perfect coverage against a pretty good route. He was all over that pass. This sophomore corner. His coaches are really excited about what he'll do for the program over the next few years. The offense will take the field, hoping for a better result than their last drive. He can't dwell on the interception. There's still a whole lot of football to be played today. Here comes the pressure. Aaron and out long. It's broken up. McCall's the kind of athlete that you can build your entire offense around. His athleticism, second to none. We'll see if they have an answer for him today. From their own 34-yard line. It's second down. Quick strike, and he drops it. This quarterback has got to do a better job of looking off defenders and allow his covered receivers some room to improvise and get free. There's the strike complete. Tackle. 
around the 45-yard line. Scramble. Throws it in a hurry. And down he goes. Right around the 24-yard line. It's first and ten. Ball on the 24-yard line. Throws it to the outside. This one will fall incomplete. Well, the execution here is very good by the offense. The quarterback did a nice job of reading the defense and put the ball in a position to be able to make the catch. The problem is the wide receiver did not focus and concentrate and hold on to the ball. Gets out to about the 21. That's good for three yards. Third down. Third down again. Looks to the end zone and is caught. Touchdown. Their last drive ended with a touchdown. Let's see what happens on this possession. As long as this quarterback has time to throw, and you can guarantee that he'll find the open man. Quickly to the tight end. Incomplete. It's second and ten. Ball on the 43. They come out in a five wide set. Dives and he's down. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wide outs. receiver. They'll bring him down around the 39-yard line. From the 39-yard line, it's first down. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. He's at the 20, and he's tackled at the 14. From the 14-yard line, first down. Slings it. Nothing going on that one. It's a nice catch by the junior wide receiver, but an even better effort by the defense to keep him from going anywhere. 98 Weasel! 98 Weasel! He throws! Off his hands and incomplete. Number 15, the intended receiver on the play. That brings us This is the eighth play of this drive. complete over the middle and he's taken down at the two-yard line players in there got it touchdown It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. Now he tries to buy some time. He's out to the 30. Fumble! And no one can get it. It bounces out of bounds.
from their own 37 yard line. First down. In the shotgun and five wide outs. He's going to try and scramble. He's tackled at the 45 yard line. And they make the stop around the 47-yard line. That is exactly the type of play that good linebackers make on a regular basis. And if you can make enough of them in college, you're probably going to get a chance to play at the next level. From the 47-yard line, second down. He's on the run. And he's shoved out of bounds at the 37. He's going to come up short. Good tackle. Couldn't get that additional yard he needed to keep the drive moving. No, he was trying to muscle his way past those big guys, but they stood their ground. Gets to about the 34-yard line. First and 10. Ball in 34. Gains his way to the 26 yard line. That makes it second and two. Well, that's a big-time play there, and as a quarterback, you're willing to take certain chances with certain wide receivers. It's, you're not going to put the ball into coverage like that very often, but if you have confidence and trust and you've worked out a lot with that wide receiver, you know what his abilities are, and you know that you have confidence and he's going to be able to come down. And they'll score! Things are on the verge of getting out of hand before we even hit the half. These next few drives are going to go a long way in determining what kind of game this will end up being. He's hit and taken down. And that's what we were talking about earlier. Absolutely. Nice pass play here. The quarterback shows some guts here throwing this one into coverage, but good accuracy and, again, great timing on the throw. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 33. He gets it out to about the 47-yard line. Man left, man left. Down, down. He makes his way to about the 42. First and ten. Ball on the 42-yard line. Throws it. He's at the 20. The senior makes the catch. He gets hit out of bounds around the two-yard line. and goal with the defense trying to regroup after giving up the big pass. He tackles him for a loss. Well, you can really mess with an offense's game plan if you can take away their ability to run. Touchdown. Now 
not much of a problem getting the ball in the end zone on their last drive as this quarterback just picked apart the defense. If you can bet this defense made some adjustments on the sideline, though. I don't know if they can stop the passing attack, but they need to at least be able to slow it down. Knocked out of bounds at the 42-yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 42. Great concentration to haul it in. And they push him out around the 29-yard line. hit immediately. The offense calls a timeout. Guys, I really like what the offensive coordinator is doing here. Throwing it on first and second down to keep the defense guessing. It's first down and they'll be looking for six points here. And it pays off. Touchdown. He kept it himself and created the whole thing with his what? And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. Gets to around the 42. From their own 42-yard line, it's first down. Here he goes. Decides to slide. McCall gets six yards after taking it himself on the option. Sheds that one. Nice run, and he's brought down. That makes it first and ten. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 46. He's at the 30. The 10. He scores. What a play. It's early in this game, so the defense can still have an opportunity to make some adjustments. But if things don't turn around in a hurry, it's really going to start to affect the psyche of the defensive line. He's going right. And they couldn't hook up on that one. There was just no way anybody could catch up with that pass. That makes it second and ten. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 22. Scrambling around. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. Steps out of bounds. Around the 26-yard line. That'll bring him 36. He's got space to work. Tackle made right around the 48-yard line. That's good for a game of eight yards. That makes it second and two. Go down, go down. Hey, check my 33. Check my 33. Easy, easy, easy. Brought right down right around the 44-yard line. It's first and ten. Ball on the 44-yard line. And they get nice yardage on that run. Tackle 
tackles him hard at the 21-yard line. First and 10, ball on the 21. Now he's scrambling. Here comes the pressure, heading for the corner. He goes out of bounds at the 18. It's the ninth play of the drive. The 10. And there's another one. And I think the defense was... The fullback. No doubt about it. The defense was following the quarterback the entire way on that option play. And the next thing you know, whew, the fullback's in the end zone. I was really impressed with their last series. They came out with a focus on the passing game, and the offense got the job done. We'll see if they have the same strategy here. That makes it second and six. From their own 33-yard line, second down. He's scrambling. He's under pressure. The ball is loose, and the offense picks it up. Tackle around the 40-yard line. Slides down to the ground. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 48-yard line. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. Zips it to the tight end. And down he goes, right around the 42-yard line. And we reach the end of three, and this game is all but decided. 49. Six. Well, folks, we head into the fourth quarter, and this one is a blowout. There's a fumble. It's picked up by the offense. He dives, and he'll be marked down. From the 31-yard line, first down. He scrambled. Quick pass. They get on the board again. Touchdown. The offense now will take the field, and they hope to have the same success they had on their last drive. I expect him to run the ball, kill the clock, and put this one in the books. He fights forward to about the 39. Second and eight, ball on the 39. They'll bring him down at the 31 yard line. That'll bring up third and inches. Makes it to the 28-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 28-yard line. Straight run. Nothing going on there. Now he 
tries to buy some time, and he's set. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. He found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. Third down again. He's tackled at the 22-yard line. That makes it fourth and four. That makes it fourth and four. A missed field goal was the result of the last drive. We'll have to see if they can come through with something this possession. Anytime you have a shot at putting points on the board and you don't get it, you get a little frustrated. But this offense is very capable of scoring at any time. That'll make it second and four. They're about four yards away here on second down. Just over two minutes in the game. Nice run there. The defense had a great opportunity there, and they let it go. This is an offense that's clearly working clock. They've got to get more aggressive defensively and attack the line of scrimmage to be able to slow down this offense from getting first down. Nice run up the middle. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He gets out to about the 45-yard line. The running back gets two on the carry. This safety is as vicious a player as you're going to find. He will make the tackle every single time. Taken down right around the 46 yard line. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 46 yard line. He's going to try and scramble. Tries to get around the corner. He's out of bounds at the 43 yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. Under a minute left in the game. He's tackled at the 29. From the 29 yard line. First down. They make the stop around the 30-yard line. The quarterback tried to do a little too much by himself. Hey, maybe next time he'll get it out to the back so he can do something with it. Here's play number 10 on the drive. He's on the run. He's knocked out of bounds around the 20-yard line. Well, they didn't pick up the first down, but he saw that no one was open, so he made the right decision to tuck it and run. There's another. Clock keeper just keeping it. What do we want to get out of here? What an amazing game, guys. Huge win. Grayson McCall, 314 yards, five total touchdowns, 157 yards rushing. What a game. We beat the Rice Owls, 63-13. Huge win. Our offense could not be stopped. This was a must-win game to go 7-0. and 
We are now 7-0 and on the season, and we are further improving our chances at a national championship. We are number 16 in the nation, and that will sure to rise. Hopefully, we can get to top 10 after that huge win against the Rice Owls. How will this offense come alive next game? We will see. The highlights are insane. We just kept scoring on all fronts. We had tons of yards, tons of rushing yards, tons of passing yards. Let's take a look at just a little bit of it. Grayson McCall, 314 yards, three touchdowns, one pick. I wish he hadn't thrown that pick, but hey, there we go. Like and subscribe.